Hello, my artists. If you're watching this video, it's probably because you clicked on the mouse paint book on the bookshelf in your, our virtual classroom. I love this book. This book is so wonderful when it comes to mixing colors and talking about our primary colors, our yellow, blue, and red, and how it makes our secondary colors, our orange, green, and purple. Feel free to <laughs> feel free to grab a stuffy, um, a piece of paper to draw on while I read, or just listen and follow along. Mouse Paint by Ellen Walsh. Once there were three white mice on a white piece of paper. The cat couldn't find them. They must be hiding and blending into the white paper. One day, while the cat was asleep, the mice saw three jars of paint, one red, one yellow, and one blue. Oh, they're silly mice. They thought it was mouse paint. They climbed right in. Then one was red, and one was yellow, and one was blue. Oh my word, I wonder how they're going to wash that off. They dripped puddles of paint onto the paper, and the puddles looked like fun. My word, they are such silly mice. What do you think they're going to do? The red mouse stepped into a yellow puddle and did a little dance. His red feet stirred the yellow puddle until, what do you think is going to happen? I wonder, it looks like something's happening. Look, he cried. Red feet in a yellow puddle make orange. Oh my gosh, by mixing his red paint itself into the yellow puddle, it mixed together and made orange. I wonder if the other mice will do the same thing. The yellow mouse hopped into a blue puddle. His feet mixed and stirred and stirred and mixed until, what color do you think yellow and blue are going to make? Hmm. Look down, said the red mouse and the blue mouse. Yellow feet in a blue puddle make green. So blue and yellow make green. Green is one of my favorite colors and so is orange. Then the blue mouse jumped into a red puddle. He splashed and mixed and danced until, what color do you think red and blue are gonna make together? Purple, they shouted. Blue feet in a red puddle make purple. So red and blue together make the color purple. How cool is that? But the paint on their fur got sticky and stiff. So they washed themselves down to a nice soft white. Oh my word, my students, do you see what they're washing in? It says C-A-T on it, that stands for cat. They're washing themselves in the cat bowl. And painted the paper instead. They painted one part red and one part yellow. I like that they're painting on paper now. And one part blue. They mixed the red and the yellow to make an orange part. Yellow and blue to make a green part. And blue and red to paint a purple part. Wow, they have such a colorful painting. They have all their primary and secondary colors. 
but they left some white because of the cat. Probably smart because they have to hide, especially after they wash themselves up in the cat's um, drinking dish. <laughs> My friends, I thank you so much for joining me again. I love this story so much. If you want to make some art with your primary colors, your red, yellow, blue, and then with your, or your secondary colors or both, remember that red, yellow, blue, secondary colors, you need two. So when you mix two of those together, you're gonna get a secondary color. You're gonna get your green, orange or purple if you make any art feel free to send it my way i'd love to see it my artists see you soon bye